So what's up guys, Jan from Genotech here with another video. So let's not talk about the expensive speakers like JBL, JBL Extreme, JBL Go and other stony stuff. So actually we'll talk about budget speakers which one example is the KDM Music Forever KM311. So let's start the video. <laughs> Left saying she ain't got the time, yo. I double take and pray the email was a typo. I call my mate and now we're in the same lifeboat. The same day, his was cheating with a shite blow. Come on now. Okay, talking about some specs of the speaker, you'll get a full normal metal grill surrounded by a polished plastic which is almost scratch proof and doesn't matter scratches so at the bottom of the speaker you'll get two rubber grips so that your speaker will not fall okay and what about the price so the speaker costs 21 dollars as i said but it's worth the price the speaker is expanded in base and everything every stuff like that so the speaker is readily available in Amazon so I'll link the description and it is too cheap. So actually talking about the specs and the sound quality of the speaker, this speaker just performs greater than the budget. Okay, talking about some deep specs, the speaker has to be charged 2-3 to three hours to maintain and you can play songs till four hours continuously so that means that you're not gonna listen songs for four hours continuously so you can just you can run the speaker for a day obviously talking about some infrastructure of this speaker the speaker comes with usb port sd card port on and off port line in aux line in port which you have to connect with the oxy cable so i'll show you that and a DC 5 watt charging port. 5 watt is pretty budget, decent consumer of your electricity. Okay, talking about the main buttons in the speaker, you'll get the menu button, caller dial button, and a negative sign button, and a positive sign button. Now I'll show you what it shows when you on your Bluetooth speaker. Welcome to KDM Music World. Bluetooth mode. The Bluetooth device is ready to connect. This speaker can be connected via by two things, which is obviously by Bluetooth and which is the Oxy cable. Okay, if you want to connect the speaker, what you have to do is just simply turn on your Bluetooth. So it will show no. The Bluetooth device paired. So it's ready to connect. So play whatever music you want and you're ready to go. Now it works as a simple speaker. Talking about the exterior of the speaker, the speaker is not great or not bad. It is just a normal build quality. Okay, to the budget, the speaker is well built and I have no complaints about the build quality. So I have faulted once or twice and it just affected and just, just cracked a little bit. So it's type of a rug speaker to the budget, but it's not really a rug speaker. I'll give you some instructions about the speaker. So you'll get menu button and the caller dial button which is not very effective in the Bluetooth speaker and a positive sign button and a negative sign button. So if you want to play the next song or the previous song, what you have to do is if you want to play the next song, just uh, just uh, touch the positive button and if you want to play the previous song, just tap the negative button. And the next and the final part of the video is the most awaited part of the video, which is the audio test. Obviously, you will not get a sure or a 100% idea about how the speaker works or is it bad or it's good. It depends upon the microphone. If the microphone is bad in your phone or in your camera, the audio that you gain from your the speaker will be bad. So if the microphone is good, even if a small speaker, small speaker plays also, the audio will be good. So anyway, I'll just play a song. My 
text left saying she ain't got the time, yo. I double take and pray that. Okay, this video is little bit different from my other videos because I did not reveal my face or I did not show my face in this video. So I thought to make this video a little bit different from my other videos. So comment down below if this video is better or my older video is better. So if you are a new visitor, check out my other video so that you can understand what I'm saying now. So I think it's time for winding up. So if you want to if you want a quick opinion about the speaker I can blindly give 8 out of 10 due to its performance and the build quality